Hi everyone, my name is Liz and I am from Green Roast Direct and in today's video we're going to explain all about the urban heat island effect. The urban heat island effect is whenever large cities and urbanised areas replace natural land cover with dense concentrations of pavements and buildings full of man-made surfaces that absorb and retain heat. This leads to lots and lots of global issues showing an increase in energy costs, an increase in air pollution and also a big increase in heat related illnesses and mortality rates. So situations where you have very big and long heat waves in inner cities can cause unfortunately big problems for the population. Green roofing plays a really pivotal role in trying to combat and address this global issue and in today's video we're going to be able to show you exactly how that is. Here we have our demo set up and ready to go. We have our man-made slate tiled roof surface and then we have our natural seat and blanket green roof surface. So we will be able to measure the ambient surface temperature of both of these surfaces here and compare them. So first of all we're going to measure the surface temperature of the slate roof and as you can see that's giving us a rating of 10.6 degrees Celsius. Let's go over to the green roof and you can see we've got a rating of 9.9 .9 degrees Celsius. So overall the ambient temperature is similar in the two structures. The green roof does show a slightly cooler temperature. We are just going to move now in front of the log burner. Both of the surfaces have been sitting directly in front of the log burner now for around 5 to 10 minutes. Okay, so we're going to start and measure the surface temperature of the slate roof. So the surface temperature of the slate roof here is giving us a rating of 32.8 Celsius. And if we then move over and measure this temperature of the seat and blanket, we can see a dramatic drop. It is right down to 12.5 degrees Celsius. And what's actually even more important is that is very similar to the ambient measurement given of the room. So there has been very, very little heat absorption and retention from the green roof. Whereas from the slate roof, we have seen a big, big increase in temperature. 